Hello, it's time to make another uh, update of our Sarti icon set. A lot has happened, about 40 days of work went into restyling, re-editing, resampling, reorganizing a new structure, trying to make it as concise as possible, as manageable as possible, no double work. Um, if one icon is changed, then all 18 sets will have the same change occurring. Uh, things like that and uh, without further ado, let's have a look at the icon set what it is now and uh, we're uh, August 13, 2016 I've chosen for a wind Y dark uh, look here and then the same for um, windows controls It's standard. It's uh, the standard theme for Linux Mint 18 cinnamon Sardi comes in many flavors Sardi maybe first quick look at the folders Control H this is the normal folder look and then you see the programs are looking like this everything is fixed there's a tutorial on it 40 tutorials very concise tutorials telling you how to get this image how to get here what you see and it's on YouTube, Sardi Arc is the next on the list it's a new one, two days old combination of the colorful icons here on the top so nothing has changed but the folders, the folders have changed in color ok, that's Sardi Arc Sardi Colora is another idea when I thought it would be interesting to be able to change colors of icons and um, in this regard all the icons are still the same but the folder icons are changed in color and if you want to have uh, if you want to color them, color them red you can do so or blue or any color uh, there is a little script available in the icons here and you can see in the Sardi Colora that you can have a change of color just copy paste RGB colors inside like FF, FF, FF which is white and 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 which is black and everything in between you can change these uh, folders so that's Sardi Colora maybe let this uh, let it open here uh, so that's the idea to change uh, the folders of color Sardi Flat has the same is another idea is working on the icons but without the rings so the white rings have gone these are the rings with the shadow why not remove all the rings and the shadows and then you get the flat icon theme which is then called Sarti flat okay so yes it is quite some work to do all that and then Sardi Flat Majestic, so it's based on the flat icons but the uh, folders change a bit dark or darker and they keep coming up in the toolbars all these little icons so that is Sardi Flat Majestic Sardi Flat Orange is if you want some coloring in your folders but still want the flat icons so it's a combination of folders and Sardi Flat. Maybe that's a good thing to say now. You understand that there are main themes. Sardi is a main theme. Sardi Flat is one. Sardi Flexible is one. Sardi Mono is one. And Sardi Ghost Flexible. So there are five main themes. Okay. Sardi Flat Orange. We've had that one. Sardi Flexible is all the way blue. Everything blue everything everywhere except as you saw the recent files but all the rest is blue so again this is an uh, interesting thing because there's a little script here slightly flexible and you can change the color and I also have a little script to surprise me just give me a random color color you would never use and it's oh, that's also nice okay this is not needed anymore we can get rid of that and then 
start the flexible arc. If we have all these blue icons, why not combine them with the blue color of arc, which come from Horst and GitHub. So that's another idea. So all these ideas come up, and then I try to word them out. Sardi Ghost Flexible is also a great look, but you need to have a dark wallpaper for it. So you can see your icons very good. So everything is white, and not all of them, many of them are the result of, let's go back to Sardi, of these white icons here are being used sometimes or not, depends on what I had because it also is built on another theme I found which is all white don't have the resource or the, the source anymore of it and then we have Sardi Flexible sorry, closer. Yeah, okay. Sardi Mono is the next one a lot of things to say and not so many, much time to do it Sardi Mono is another one I see there is okay every icon should be grey not grey and all the same grey but dark grey, light grey some difference is okay but it should be monochrome it should be some kind of grey and we keep the folders from Sardi then the idea came why not combine Sardi Mono with Arc so we have all these grey icons but blue folders. Next up is the Sardemono Grey which makes everything very dark and gloomy but if it's late at night maybe it's soothing for your eyes. Alright so next one is Sardemono Mint X Grey being a Linux Mint uh, user then you can reuse your own Mint icons if you do like them then you have a combination of again Sardi Mono icons and then the icons of the folders of Mono Mint X Grey Sardi Mono Numix is coming from the Numix team which is a very beautiful team the icon um, Numix circle icon theme is a beautiful one and these are the folders of these guys Okay combination of grey and yellow makes it actually quite beautiful or orange Sardi Mono Numix going to Sardi Mono Numix Grey then I had this idea why not recolor these icons and make it a little bit darker again not so much light or brightness and color the icons next up Sardi Mono Orange making icons which are quite flat, not uh, 3D or anything, no shadows, nothing very flat look and combine it with the Sardi Mono the vertex is maybe some an icon team you know also from uh, Horst at GitHub and I have combined both of them so the icons are Mono and the folders are coming from from the vertex team but sometimes you want this kind of look that is I want some colors but I want to keep the grey or greyish vertex icons and then we have had every icon set that's possible so you download this um, from source forge and you can select it here anything you like there are 18 sets at this moment yes you see here another one I'll make another movie about that this is another theme I've made but this was more a study and this is really meant to be maintained Sardi 